William Inga, Priest. William Ralph Inga KCVOFBA, slash slash, June 6, 1860, February 26, 1954, was an English author, Anglican priest, professor of divinity at Cambridge, and Dean of St. Paul's Cathedral, which provided the appellation by which he was widely known, Dean Inga. He was nominated for the Nobel Prize in Literature three times. Life. He was born on June 6, 1860 in Crake, Yorkshire. His father was William Inca, provost of Worcester College, Oxford, and his mother Susanna Churden, daughter of Edward Churden, Archdeacon of Cleveland. Inga was educated at Eton College, where he was a King's Scholar and won the Newcastle Scholarship in 1879, and at King's College, Cambridge, where he won a number of prizes, as well as taking firsts in both parts of the classical tripos. He was a tutor at Hartford College, Oxford starting in 1888, the year he was ordained as a deacon in the Church of England. His only parochial position was as Vicar of All Saints, Knightsbridge, London, from 1905 to 1907. In 1907, he moved to Jesus College, Cambridge, on being appointed Lady Margaret's Professor of Divinity. Then, in 1911, Prime Minister H. H. Asquith chose him to be the Dean of St. Paul's Cathedral in London. He served as president of the Aristotelian Society at Cambridge from 1920 to 1921. Inga then became a columnist for the Evening Standard, a position he would hold until 1946. Inga was also a trustee of London's National Portrait Gallery from 1921 until 1951. He had retired from full-time church ministry in 1934. He was made a commander of the Victorian Order, CBO, in 1918 and promoted to Knight Commander, KCBO, in 1930. He received honorary doctorates of divinity from both Oxford and Aberdeen universities, honorary doctorates of literature from both Durham and Sheffield, and honorary doctorates of laws from both Edinburgh and St. Andrews. He was also an honorary fellow of both King's and Jesus Colleges at Cambridge, and of Hartford College at Oxford. In 1921, he was elected as a fellow of the British Academy. Many of Inga's views were unusual at the time. He disapproved of democracy, which he called an absurdity and compared it to the famous occasion when the voice of the people cried, Crucify him. He was also known for his support for nudism. Inga supported the publishing of Maurice Parmalee's book, The New Gymnosophy, Nudity and the Modern Life. Inga was also critical of town councillors who were insisting that bathers wear full bathing costumes. Family. Inga's wife, Mary Catherine, was the daughter of Henry Maxwell Spooner. She died in 1949. His daughter, Paula, developed type 1 diabetes before insulin was widely available in the UK and died age 14. Inga spent his later life in Brightwell, where he died on February 26, 1954, aged 93. Legacy Inga was a prolific author. In addition to scores of articles, lectures and sermons, he also wrote over 35 books. He is best known for his works on Plotinus and Neoplatonic philosophy, and on Christian mysticism. He was a strong proponent of the spiritual type of religion, that autonomous faith which rests upon experience and individual inspiration as opposed to one of coercive authority. He was therefore outspoken in his criticisms of the Roman Catholic Church. His thought, on the whole, represents a blending of traditional Christian theology with elements of Platonic philosophy. He shares this in common with one of his favorite writers, Benjamin Whichcote, the first of the Cambridge Platonists. He was also a eugenicist and wrote considerably on the subject. In his book Outspoken Essays, he devotes an entire chapter to this subject. He was nicknamed the Gloomy Dean because of his pessimistic views in his Romanus Lecture of 1920, The Idea of Progress and in his Evening Standard articles and he is remembered as a supporter of animal rights. Publications The following bibliography is a selection taken mainly from Adam Fox's biography Dean Inga and his biographical sketch in Crockford's Clerical Directory.